Okay, hi guys, welcome back to Felicia Nicole's Stories. And today we're gonna do a what's in my kid, no, what my kid got for Christmas. Not a what's in your stocking. We did that already. Okay, so we're doing what's in my, what's my kid got for Christmas. So today we're doing just my eight year old daughter, Kaden. Um, if you are new here, um, I'm Felicia. I'm a mom, a nurse, and a wife. And I'm a mom to three children. I have a 13-year-old son, Amar. And I have an 8-year-old daughter, Kaden. And I have a 2-month-old daughter, Kamari. And those are my three children. So today we're just doing Kaden's um, gifts for Christmas. I um, already recorded Amar's gifts for Christmas. And I already and, um, I recorded Kamari's gift for Christmas. So if you're looking for ideas for around that price range um check out the video um above or below or whatever <laughs> they're on this page check them out <laughs> so we're just gonna get started because kaden got quite a bit and we're trying to do this while she's out with her dad christmas shopping so i want to get it done before she comes home so she asked for a blue tablet case so we just picked up a silicone blue tablet case from the amazon pretty plain and simple she got a Barbie. She actually got two Barbie dolls. A girl and a guy to go together. Um, this one was purchased from Five Below. This one was purchased from Walmart. So this one was like five bucks. This one was like eight bucks. Like seven, eight bucks. It wasn't that much. And she got two of the... Three, two of the color reveal Barbies. I honestly don't know the difference in between the two of these Barbies at all. I don't really know what's going on with them and why is one really big and one's really small. Um, that one fell. <laughs> but I just got her two of them anyway. Got one big one, one small one. She got um, a little Barbie dog. If you um pay attention to my channel or if you're familiar here you're not new here you know that kaden is really into animals so i try to pick her up some things that are animal related so she got two little dogs one came with a little car and a little uh so she got two little um dogs this got the little car with it and this one got the little um in it with the little ferris wheel thingy like the little things you spin on at the park oh spinning merry-go-round that's what it's called Kamari, you okay, honey? You okay, mama? And this one came with the dog house and a pool. Um, and she got the LOL Little Sisters. I think this is a pet. I don't know. I really don't know. But LOL Littles, I don't know what's in it. I don't know. Mari, you want to give her her bubble? Okay, so little mama was crying, so she's joining us, trying to hurry up and get this done. Right, little mama? Say hi. Okay, she's not looking right now. So she got a cell phone for her birthday. And she's constantly moving the things on my table when she's in there eating and watching her shows. So I got her a little stand so she can use her cell phone um, at the table, I guess, without moving my stuff. Oh, you all right? So she got this, the, the cell phone holder to hold her cell phone while she's eating um she got this little oh i didn't bring the jury over i'll record that supper so she got um this little box that she could put her little knickknacks in for whatever she want to do with it whatever little knickknacks she is getting um a couple pieces of jewelry for christmas so maybe she can put her jewelry in this or maybe her little pieces from her lols or whatever i'm not sure so again, she really loves um, animals, and she talk about the Apollonis horse, which I didn't know anything about because I don't know anything about horses. And when I saw that this was the Apollonis horse, I figured I'll pick it up for her that she would enjoy that and be excited because she likes those kind of horses. She got two of the LOL surprise lights, lights and glitter. So, I don't know. I guess this is one of the series because LOL seems to have a bunch of series. So, she got two of those balls to unbox. She This is what she asked for. 
she asked for a lot of our generation doll accessories um she specifically asked for the kit our generation doll kitchen which we saw it in target when we went out one day um and when i went back to get it it was gone and from it sold out it sold out online it sold out in stores i went to three different targets around me and it's gone so i was unable to get that so i got other things so she got the she actually did that for a bunch of our generation doll accessories so she got this which is the packed for picnic set so it does have the food and it has the plates and the cups and stuff with it got the utensils so i figured since she wanted a kitchen set she got at least have the food um she got this i'm just grabbing stuff there's no particular order to this so she got this lol um omg fashion journal so the journal comes with the lock the watch locks the journal and it comes with two invisible ink pens so you just have to use a magic light to see what she writes with the pens i just thought that was really really nice she's into drawing she's into fashion she actually it really enjoys fashion um and stuff like that so i thought that would be really nice for her and she enjoys writing i'm constantly buying her journals but mostly when she gets journals she writes songs in them so if she chooses to draw fashion stuff in it cool if she chooses to write songs in it cool either way it's hers again with the song writing this goes along with the the fact that she likes to write songs she got a karaoke set so um, her father got a mic for christmas last year but he got like one of the studio type mics and he let her sing in it sing in it or whatever and she enjoyed that i didn't get her that kind but i did get her a karaoke mic where she could stream from her cell phone she could stream the music from her cell phone and, and see the lyrics and so forth and it come with headsets so we all don't have to hear it or have mercy we have to hear her sing at the top of her lungs when she's singing to alexa but at least we don't have to hear the music as as well <laughs> not that i don't like to listen to her stuff but sometimes mommy needs a break so she could plug her headphones into her um phone and then you know have her little mic and do her little sing-along and she can record herself actually yeah the mic lets you record yourself so she could play it back at a later date um or it has the wireless speakers on the mic that plays the music from her phone or her tablet and then the head the headphones to go along with it so that's really cool i gotta move some of this stuff out the way we got to move some stuff so that we can get to it so i'm just gonna put the stuff on the floor because not only do i have to record this video and show you this video so before she gets back i have to put all this stuff away before she gets back or try to start wrapping it so she got um horses the spirit horses um she got two of them i don't know the difference in between them i never watched spirit but she likes spirit this one is called spirit i guess this is the actual spirit horse and this one is chica linda <laughs> um this is a variety pack of accessories and outfits that um for the 18 inch doll which is the, the american doll the american doll not the american doll the our generation doll is a, a 18 18 inch doll but it was um way more affordable to buy a variety pack of outfits on amazon so in this thing, she gets seven outfits, two pairs of shoes, and two purses. And this was like, I want to say $25, maybe $30, when each individual outfit is like $17 bucks at um, Target for each individual um, our generation outfit. And the shoes were like 7 bucks each, too. So I just bought this. So then she gets a bunch of outfits, a bunch of shoes, well, two pairs of shoes and two purses for her dogs. And she asked for the Our Generation Dow travel set. Um, I didn't see it in store. And I found this on Amazon. It's an 18-inch dial travel set. So it comes with the luggage. The dial gets a cell phone, a camera, a laptop, a makeup carrying case, sunglasses, the neck pillow, a brush, lotion, and her passport and plane tickets. 
so all of this was included in this it's not our generation dial but it does fit the um 18 inch dial Now this is uh, the our generation dial um this is part of their what is it called a hospital collection i think it's called the hospital collection which i am loving that collection that collection i don't know if you guys know or if i mentioned i am a nurse kaden um says that she wants to be a doctor not only does she wants to be a doctor she wants to own a hospital when she's an adult so i like to cater to that um desire so this is part of the our generation dial hospital collection and it's a wheelchair what is it called Hill, oh heels on wheels so it is so stinking cute it come with the wheelchair the cast band-aids crutches the little pin to sign the cast ace wrap the ice pack x-rays a stethoscope so they can she can really get her doctor around with this she currently has two 18 inch dials one is our generation and one is my life so this is going to be her third um 18 inch dial that she's getting and this is it she's getting the doctor i dream to be a family doctor i don't know what her which one she planned to be but it's a little black girl because we believe in black girl magic and you know keeping her empowered and knowing that she as a little black girl can grow up to be anything she wants to be this doll name is megan and she has a little stethoscope so now she's got two stethoscopes she has some more x-rays she has a blood pressure cuff a notepad a prescription pad and pen and um just a few little trinkets and i think that this is really cute i am loving this this is like i think this is personally my favorite gift that i got her for christmas um it may not be her favorite gift but it's mine <laughs> i'll be curious to know what her favorite gift is and i hope to share that with you guys so she also got the lol carpool coop so i don't know i just i thought this was really cute and she showed me the um lol commercial of the girls pulling up in the car coop and they were singing a song and so forth so i thought she would really like this so i picked this up for her. i gotta get up and go over there to get the rest of this stuff huh. look at my cameraman he's bomb moving it all closer to me okay thank you okay so since he put the clothes on top i'll put the clothes so she got um a t-shirt with um, it says be kind to the planet, which is definitely her. I can't really show you the whole thing because I didn't take it out. But it says recycle, plant a tree, and bring your own bags. So um, this is from Children's Place. And it's so perfect for Caden because Caden asked me, could we buy a tree? Um, or whatever the heck it's called. Yeah, buy a tree. So I guess you purchase, this is what she said. I think you said, you, I don't know where she sort is at, but I think it's like $20.00. And it plants 20 trees for a year or something. I don't know. So she's into that kind of stuff. That's that's her jazz. So I thought that shirt would be cute. So this shirt is um actually for baby sister. So I got her and her baby sister look-alike shirts because uh, that's my jam. <laughs> so this one says best big sister. And the one for her little sister says best little sister. So those are the two shirts for the girls and they got two more shirts alike so this one is a little unicorn and it says sister squad so it's like unicorn cupcakes and they both got one because they're the sister squad it's my girls it's fun when you have two girls you dress them alike are you recording me too or just the stuff i'm recording you too huh recording you too you recording me too oh, okay Okay, so then she got some boots. She got a pair of gray um, knee-high boots. 
and these came from the children's place as well i think they were on sale for about 20 25 dollars they are let's see if i can see what the normal price is for these they're normally 45 dollars so i think i got them for like 20 or 25 dollars they're gray um thigh high boots she did ask for shoes for christmas so that's the shoes that i chose for her and because she couldn't get the kitchen um and i wanted to make sure she got food related items i am not in that clip am i i want to be in the clip can i be in the clip too my son is recording me so he's getting to see his sister's christmas gifts early he better not tell her what she getting for christmas <sighs> so this is the hot dog cart so it's the our generation dial hot dog cart i tried to get things that were food related since she couldn't get the kitchen so she got the hot dog cart it comes with hot dogs pretzels sodas with ketchup and mustard they got the little thing to put up here got money so she could you know act like she has customers maybe she could put it also if i could i want to get the whole hospital collection eventually it's gonna take some time to get all of that because it keep being sold out <laughs> like they, they got an ambulance they got a stretcher and it's like the stuff is sold out and then, i don't know it's aggravating me so i have to wait to get it but maybe she could put this outside her little hospital and they could get the doctor go out and get a hot dog on his lunch break i don't know i just thought it was so cute so that's what she got and going with the food theme we almost done thank goodness um going along with the food theme because i couldn't find the kitchen i got this as well and this is the farmer's market set which i actually got on a really good deal because i guess it's normally 50 dollars for the farmer's market set and this was a online i guess they only sell it online but it was returned to the store so they marked it down to from from 50 to 43 dollars and because the box has a little rip right here they gave me more money off so i got it for 38 dollars but you know once the tax come it is right back up to 40 bucks so instead of getting it for 50 dollars i got it for 38 dollars and she got two gifts from two small businesses two custom actually she got three gifts from small businesses but one did not come at all yet so and i ordered it in november and it didn't come yet but whatever no 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 no. that one i didn't order in november i'm lying but i ordered a few weeks ago but it still hasn't come so whatever i don't know well, i'm not gonna stress myself over it but this i actually created i showed you guys in another video of custom made presents so this was a custom made present that um my supervisor made for her she actually made some of these for my cousins so this just got the i'm not gonna go through exactly everything that was in this gift because i actually have a whole video for this but this was another custom gift that she's gonna get and hold on one second and i'll show you the jewelry that she's getting that was custom made okay so this is the custom jewelry that she got <sighs> okay so these were custom pieces that i ordered from a small local business and I'm going to give an honest review. Hold on. Look at me. Look at me. Not not the stuff. I'm going to give an honest review. I ordered these. Kaden's favorite color is teal. She likes to call it seafoam green. And that's what I asked for. And this is what I got. This is not teal or seafoam green. I understand. She said that her resin in that color did not come in on time to make these things. To deliver them by the date that she told me that she was going to deliver them by. And she chose to do this, make this in navy, opposed to just reaching out to me and asking me um, what color I would like. If I would like to change the color or if I would like to wait to pick up my product, she just decided to make this this color. Now, in her, and not in defense, but she did say that once the color that I did choose come in, that she would replace these with the um she will make me a whole new set for free i don't know if that's gonna happen we'll see if it does wonderful if it doesn't it just doesn't but anyway um i will link she's still i will still promote her business i will still link her below and you 
use her if you want to use her don't use her if you don't this is a hair clip that says Caden's name the work is really pretty that I have to say the work is really pretty Kamari got one in, in pink it got the little alligator clip on the back the work is really pretty that I haven't I don't have no complaints about she also got the earrings Caden got the little earrings I don't like really big earrings on little girls I feel like she's a little girl she needs to stay a little girl so I, I do not like the little girl big earrings so this is the size I chose but she got the little hoop earrings and they say Caden and they got the little blue resin and she has the necklace as well this necklace is kind of long so this is the necklace the chain is pretty long it's like see because it, it will hang kamari you okay mama well mommy almost done so it will hang pretty low on me so it's gonna hang low on her so i may have to adjust this necklace but this is the necklace that she got and it says her name and it's actually really pretty so that's all that kaden is getting for christmas i think it's enough i don't know if it's well, i don't know i don't know if it's too much too little or so forth but that's what she's getting that's what she's getting for christmas um let me know if anything below anything that i have that picked up for kaden that you picked up for your kids or anything that you think i should have gotten her or did you get your kids more or less so forth what's going on but in, so like and subscribe and keep oh that was cool so like and subscribe and keep in contact with us but we're gonna go because she is already her dad already called they already checked out at the store so we have to get this stuff hidden and get this little whiny baby settled all before she gets back so thank you for watching and th so this ripstick is um i don't know one of the kids so i got two of them exactly the same for my son amar and for my daughter Kaden and as you can see the box is getting tore up trying to hide it <sighs> the box is getting messed up but whatever this was picked up at Marshall's no I'm lying TJ Maxx and it was $39.99 and I got two of them the exact same thing this was too big to put on the bed to sh show you guys Okay, so I think I forgot to say one more thing that my children are both getting for. No, all three of them are getting for Christmas. Um, so actually, I can use this clip for both videos. So I purchased my children a vending machine for Christmas. Um, it's a three-head vending machine. It's huge. So the box, you can't even tell what it is in the box anyway. So I will insert a picture. But it's a three probe vending machine. It's one of the coin operated machines. And um, so each kid will get a head that they're responsible for. So they'll fill it up um, and collect the coins or whatever and maintain the machine. Um, it, they're, so basically we're starting a vending machine business for them. Um, they will be responsible for deciding what candy to put in there. Um, they will be responsible for going and refilling the candy. They won't do it theirself, of course. I mean, like, they won't go to the place theirself or be, you know what I mean? Like, we'll be on a schedule, like, hey, today's the day we're going to go. And they can refill the machines, empty it, get their, um, profit out or their, get their money out and uh they'll be taught um how to determine what is profit what is um money to reinvest in your business and what you can be paid and so forth so they're basically going to be learning how to run their own vending machine business this is going to be their i want to say it's going to be their first bit their first own business but it kind of will be um so be their first business that gives them um, residual income. Maybe that's what I'll say. What it'll be because it's going to require minimal. It requires minimal um, effort. You know what I mean. So 
I mean, there is some effort into it, but it's minimal compared to clocking into something every day and having to market something every day or having to produce a product and so forth. It's kind of a set it, come back, check on it, do a little bit and go kind of business. So I do want to teach them that structure of business as well as um, my girls are going to be launching um, their own boutiques in the new year, online boutiques. Um, Kaden would like their first main product to be lip gloss. So they will be making, well, with my help, Kamari won't be making anything, but she will be a part of this as well as far as um, profits go. So any profits that's earned, they will be going into... <laughs> A portion will be going towards their college savings fund and a portion will be going towards a regular saving for them. And then what they also will, of course, because I believe in, um, I do believe in letting them seek a reward. So they will have a portion that they can spend on whatever they would like to spend on, to spend on what of their, um, off their business. Um, I know in the beginning, the business will be slow, so they won't see as much. So I will be, um, just to, I think I will match their earnings when they're not making a, enough where they can go and get themselves something from the store. I will be giving them something so that they will be able to go and purchase themselves something and feel some type of little reward for from it until it brings in a profit enough for them to be able to get themselves something or whatever. Because I don't, I don't want them to get discouraged or feel as if they're doing so much and not getting anything out of it. I don't know. I really got to think that through. But I definitely want to teach them business, how to run a business. I want them to teach that they don't have to rely on a 9 to 5. But they also can maintain a 9 to 5 and run a business if they would like. I just want to show them more to life. So, Caden is like all the way for it. Like, hands down. I mean, they're both far. But when I say she all in, like, I don't have to push her to drink big. That girl says she owns. She not only going to be a doctor, she's going to own the hospital. And boom for it. You could do it. I believe in you. I, and I love that you dream big. And I believe she can do it. I mean, what's stopping her from doing it? There's nothing from nothing that's stopping her from doing it. She's putting it in an atmosphere at eight years old that she is going to be a doctor and she is going to own a hospital. And I support her 135%, 150%. I'm completely behind her on that. Um, I just want to start her off with skills that she can learn to help her reach that goal that she likes to reach. You know, and so um, after discussing it, and I did discuss with them, so this is not their, um, well, the vending machine is a present. They know nothing about it. They, it wasn't discussed with them. Um, but as far as her starting lip gloss, I asked her what would she like to sell? What would she like to do? And she said lip gloss. And Amar, when I discussed with him, what would he like to say? He said he would like to get back into cooking, selling some types of food, maybe dinners. He was like, maybe he can get into selling his sauces again. Because he did used to make sauce and sell them. And now he's kind of like expanded in the sauce range on um, what kind of sauces he's making and so forth. So we're going to go down that road and see how he can do that. And, it's, you know, it's a lot to do with... um. We're looking into um, the production side of it, how we can product, produce it and um, preserve it and so forth. Um, yeah, so that's what they're going to be doing in the new year. I kind of went on a whole ramble when I was only supposed to tell you guys that they're getting a vending machine for Christmas. I'm giving my babies their first business. They're getting a vending machine. I will insert the picture of the vending machine because it's too big for me to show it. And it's still in a box and it's not put together yet. So I will insert my baby's vending machines that they're getting for Christmas. <laughs>